Hello and welcome back to another tutorial. Today we will be going through fishing, how to craft hooks and what you'll need to set up. To craft improvised hooks, simply take some bones to your hand and uh, you'll need a knife. Um, look at the knife and craft improvised fishing hook by simply holding the left mouse button and wait for the animation to finish. Once it's finished, you'll notice the hook will drop to the ground. This is a quick and easy way of being able to make cost-effective hooks. Um, and all you'll need to do is hunt any animal to get bones. There's also fishing hooks, uh, which are metal fishing hooks, uh, which you can also buy at the trader. In Jeb's Fishing, they have a lot of different hooks also. These ones you'll have to find out in the map. So now what you'll need is a rod. In Jeb's Fishing, they come in four different colours. Purple, blue, red or green. These rods are only available out in the map. Not available at the trader. you also notice that the fishing reel is a different colour. Now what you need is some bait. To dig up worms, simply take a knife to your hand and look at the ground. You'll get a prompt, dig up worms. Hold your left mouse button, um, hold it down and just wait for the animation to finish. Then you'll find on the ground you've dug up an earthworm. That will be perfect for your bait. Now take your bone fishing hook from earlier. Uh, you can take the worm from the ground and simply hover over the combined icon. Then left mouse button, uh, hold and wait for the animation to finish. Now you have your bone fishing hook all ready with the bait. Once you have a baited hook, you can take the baited hook and drag it into the hook icon once you have the fishing rod in your hands. Now you're ready to start fishing. Just walk up to any body of water and look for the start fishing icon. Hold the left mouse button and wait for the icon to finish. This can circle a number of times. Uh, don't worry, just keep holding the left mouse button um, and wait to see what you may catch. If you're fishing in salt water or fresh water, you catch different fish. Here, I'm fishing in a freshwater pond. Oh, I think I've caught something. Oh, I caught a minnow. Let's start fishing again. Oh, that was faster. Oh, I caught some wellies. An important part of fishing is not to give up though, because as real fishing, uh, you know that um, sometimes you catch a fish and sometimes you don't. Jeb's fishing rod also has some fishing hats and some fishing shirts so you can look the part. They also have bamboo fishing nets so that you can catch minnows. These can be fixed by using a sewing kit. Also there's a minnow bucket that you can use once you've caught your minnows um, for your bait. Um, also with bait they do have a worm container um, which is really cool. Uh, you can actually put your worms in the container ready for use after you've dug them up um, which is a really handy way of storing your worms. I couldn't resist getting changed into some of the fishing items just to have a wee try to see what it was like. I'm quite liking them. Now we're at the ocean I thought we would have a wee try just to show you that it's exactly the same apart from the different options of fish. So again, you just look for the start fishing icon, hold the left mouse button and wait for the animation to finish. No, no luck that time. Let's try again. Always check your hook in between casts to make sure that you still have bait. If you don't, just replace it uh, 
by the process we covered earlier. Sometimes it can take a number of circles to get a bite. You'll know when you've got something on because you'll feel the rod pull upwards and you'll hear a click sound. Oh, just like that. I wonder what we've got. Oh, looks like I've caught a shark. It may be too big to fit in my inventory, but no worries. We can cut it up. All you need to do is get a knife, look for the icon, cut and prepare, hold the left mouse button, and wait for the animation to finish. Oh yeah, what a good catch. Oh, that's better. Now you can fit them in your inventory to take them to the market or to have them for a tasty snack. Well, that was a very successful fishing trip. Good luck out there. Take care.